Hello, hello, and I am your host, Nevada, and today we are playing once again Sonic Adventure 2. Uh, yeah, playing Sonic Adventure 2. So let us begin, I guess. Right, we're doing the hero campaign and Aquatic Mine. It's kind of funny. I don't even have the freaking goggles that I'm supposed to have. And um, I hate this level more than any other level from the uh, Knuckles campaign, simply because. At least the other levels, even though they're larger and a little bit harder to find your way around, they're better levels. It's just like a, I don't know what, I feel like a terribly uninteresting level. Alright, so down here, yeah it is. All right. I don't have the breathing thing, so I can't do a, uh, and the controller still ain't worried. Alright, let me, let me Alright, we're gonna try to fix it in the real controls, if I can. <laughs> oh, uh, can I not? Options. No. Separation. I can only go to. Oh, okay. Sweet. So you can't do that. All right. This one, though, you don't know, make sure I couldn't control that. You know. So yeah, we have inverted control for the rest of the game. Right. Oh God. I hate this level a whole lot. Let's just say that. I think he's in the control room now. Something other than the minecart. So with F, we let's first uh, lower the level. I think to lower it all the way down, you have to go to the top. Shut up, Pana Chow. Can I hurt one of you? I knew where the uh, breathing thing. I know it's in here in this level somewhere. Pretty sure the water breathing thing is in this level. Don't know where. Remember where it is. I think I need to go all the way to the very bottom, which means I need to go to the top because I believe that's the only way to uh, get rid of the uh, the uh, water level switch or something. Really, do I have to... Alright, let's go switch one. Get to the water so we can go up top. Because we'll jump on this. We'll jump on this, and then we'll fight Ghost. Here's a shrine. What do you have to say, Omchow? Really, Chow, I'm Chow, that's what you have to say? Wait, can I... I need the magic flute. I don't have the magic flute. Or do I? Wait, do you? I don't remember. Do you, yeah, I don't think I have magic flute. Oh my god. Great. Just die. Where is he? Only I remember where the other thing is. Let's look at the other thing. Narrow path. Yeah, it's definitely, I know. Of course, I don't know where I am in relation to anything else in this level. So awful. Yes, anyway. Yay! Oh my. And the camera is god awful. I don't know why I did that. Alright. Above a pair of skulls, where it's high. That doesn't mean. That means literally nothing to me. The largest room. So it's this room? For the scrolls, uh, how do I get out of here? It's supposed to be a jumpy thing. Jump pad. So this is the largest room, so it has to be in here somewhere. I guess maybe we just fly around till we get a uh, confirmation. Or not. Uh, uh, close. Here? Nope. Oh, Jesus, goddamn ghost! So, huh. Where's that? Oh, you get to the secret wall or something? I don't know. Can you at least give me a hint that's useful? Oh, 
Oh my god, I hate you so much. Which <laughs> I was literally the worst thing ever made by a human being. Uh, so maybe there's like a shortcut, like in uh, those rogue levels. The levels where you're not. Uh, the, um, This is like legitimately the worst camera I've ever created by human hands. Like there is nothing worse than this. Try digging into the window frame, it looks like a window. What does that? Oh. So it's one of these things. Oh. I didn't, I didn't see these before. Huh. I still miss. All right, good. One more left. Only took us four minutes. Only five minutes. Stairs shaped in brick room. Is and time down below. Oh, great! Well, we get in the fucking camera with my worst enemy. Other hint underpass, door to pass, cost is not that one about those. Ah, uh, that area. Uh, great, just great. My number one fear about this game, and I have to go fight it. Good job. I should still be scared of these ghost things. That's one reason I am. Alright. Hopefully I don't die. I'm gonna die. Oh god, I can't see! The camera will be the death of me! Oh my god, I can't see! I need to find it! Quick! If I find it, maybe I won't die! Or if I find air? Huh? Nope, I died. The end. Oh wait, that works fine. Thought it made me be sure. Never see that on this level. Yep, still the same room. Great. Now I have to uh, you know, do the other thing. There has to be a switch that makes the water go lower than that. Or a way to go make the water go lower than that. Come on, same hints. Man, this camera really makes me hate this game. <laughs> what the point of you even existing? Do you have to use? How would that... I know it's close yet. There he is. Yay. He did the worst. We beat the worst level in the game. Now it's smooth sailing from here on out. I have to try you know what? No. Because we're never doing this level again. Knuckles. I'm serious. I am never playing this level again. Ah. In the capital city. Ah, here's the racing level. How many times are you from the run from police, uh, not Sonic? I think this is like the best incident of stealth ever. Just like hiding in an alley in a goddamn like blue car. It's like it's not even you know like a dark blue. It's like a light yellow and blue car. I mean, robot. And then Knuckles shows up. Because obviously those are underneath the city. That makes sense. Keepers was tougher than I thought it would be. Where are we anyway? Hey, where are you going? Move aside, Knuckles. What? I managed to find the transfer 
What? <laughs> move aside. Why is he move? Why would he move aside? What? Where are you going to go in down there? I like how easy it is to find the president. It's like whatever. Oh, if we get into the limo, we're just gonna jack the we're gonna jack the limo of the United States of the president of the United States of America, and it's like oh, not much e thing, whatever, easy as fuck. This 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 so far this game is kind of ridiculous. Obviously, it's a kids game and it's not and it's not a game, so it's obviously gonna be ridiculous. But still, also I love this road. I just love this road. It's it's in the middle of the sky, just kind of floating there. Just, uh, just driving. Just driving. Like, I don't... And I like how you'll actually see, like, regular cars on this road. It's, like, amazing. Like, who would, like... Where are you even going? There's no exit ramps or anything. And I just killed you. I also like how you just, like, I don't know, kind of mercifully murder a crap load of people. And there's no real good reason why. Like, see, that guy, he was probably just going home, you know, probably picked up his kid from school, and, uh, then a freaking thing showed up out of nowhere. Also, there's, like, ramps. Who designed this? It's like these, these cars have the greatest suspension of all time. Like, if I had to drive like this to work every day, like, with these kind of roads, I don't think I would drive. Hey, look at this. Look at this. Up, oh, and he's dead. And he just, like, warps through the ground, too, so, I mean... Oh, is he dead? His body will never be found. He's like, they just fell off the face of the earth. Also that. They just, like, put a ramp in the middle of the street. You know, whatever. Who cares? Like, this would be okay if it wasn't, like, supposed to be, like, a real street. They didn't have, like, other cars just in the middle of the way, in the middle of the road. So they just like, oh, yeah, this is a real street that people drive on. I was like, did you find the predator yet so we can, like, you know, hijack his limousine? Like, it's that easy. Who knows? Maybe it is that easy. Maybe it is that easy to hijack the president. Or kidnap the president. Or break into his car. It's kind of disturbing if it is, but I mean, whatever. Life. I also like how this, uh, this is, like, the most. A fastest car ever. I mean, honestly, you probably would have been faster if you just flew instead of driving. Of course, then you probably get shot down by missiles. But of course, if I were, you know, or any planes, you know, hijack the president's limousine, I don't think anything else he could have done would have been more dangerous than that. I also like the city in the backdrop. Just kind of there. Oh, shit, ball. That was the worst time to do, the, do a boost ever. Oh, yeah, just the end of it. Yay, will I get A ranking? Probably not. I really, for one thing about this game, do not like how they have the backdrops. It's just like a painting. It's just really weird. It was easy as hell. I play this game way too many times. Way too many times. Mr. President, reports show and then they're like in a normal street, normal city, with normal roads. Like San Francisco, apparently. Wait, I've never been to California. Also, I like how, you know, I'm, I've been to D.C., which is where, you know, American capital is, and it's nothing like that. I was there like, I don't know, maybe a few weeks ago. Nothing like that. Yeah, probably. Mr. President, my dear fellow, listen. Surrender to the Eggman Empire and make no attempts to rebuild. Otherwise... Otherwise... I kill everybody. Cease to exist. You'll have to wait for more cars. <laughs> He's like, God! No and then up. I don't really. Yep. 
just leave it to you know like the 16 year old blue hedgehog and the eight year old two tailed fox here to save the world Who's the agent? If you don't know, you're kind of sad. Oh god, not this level. I hope it starts with the Sonic one instead of the uh, Tails one, but I'm pretty sure it's a Tails level. No, we're gonna do that right now instead of waiting for you know next episode. I like how we, nobody's mentioned a cannon whatsoever. Like, nobody's mentioned anything about a cannon. I'm pretty sure. Uh, maybe they did. I just wasn't paying attention. That's not impossible. Oh, no. Robots. Oh, God, I'm going to die. <laughs> really? Oh, man, that was awful. Okay. Damn it, die. I really hate this. It's yeah, it's sad, but it's the e easiest one to kill him to kill that guy with is um the uh as as sales and the other character. Did I do it? Damn it. I really hate that character. Oh my god, I've beaten this game a couple hundred times. I like being on this game file like twice at least. I think maybe once. Right. Here we are bringing you know the priceless artifacts that are in this probably in this uh what's it called pyramid which we're just blowing up with infinity. Because quite honestly we don't care. Like there's no reason that I got points for blowing that up. Also there's no reason why Eggman decided to put his face on every wall. Well, he's Eggman, so you know, whatever. Super villains gotta do their own thing. Okay. Also, the fact that there's this much quicksand is kind of unbelievable. Okay. Also, why do I ever even go out of plane mode? Wouldn't it be easier to just bypass all this in just plane mode? Just, I mean, it's a hell of a lot easier than having to go through all this crap. I don't know, drop in. Oh, no, I like this part where you get some of the old enemies from uh, the old Sonic games. <laughs> you know. I kind of like how they did it because it kind of uh, puts in the old Sonic games with this one. Like, basically, because whenever you're fighting gun robots, you're not fighting Eggman, you're fighting gun. Who are bad guys. <laughs> oh, look at this. He found something. Oh, this is the, uh, Miss Melody. Yay, we got Miss Melody. Did I already get him a. This one already got this already. I don't know. Does Miss Melody uh, pass on to everybody, or do you have to get this one person, or how's that work? Does anybody know? I don't want to go to Child Garden, so we're not even going to pick that up. Alright. And look at these little assholes just throwing bombs at me like nobody's. Yeah, what was I saying before? Yeah, these like old enemies from Sonic, old Sonic games past. It sort of puts those together in this universe. So it's not like, oh yeah, they're just totally different. Like a reboot, it's like, oh, it's the same place, just uh, you're not only fighting Eggman, you're fighting human robots. Also, that was the most disturbing thing I've ever seen in my life. It's all my nightmares put into flesh. They were just gonna run across here. They were just gonna just cruelly and you know, that you're more murder these poor defenseless robots. But we do not care. Oh, we play Miss Melody here. Oh my god, it's that thing. It's that guy. What do we do? We just launch missiles at him. Nobody does. Alright, yay, shortcut, or maybe long cut, or maybe, I don't know. What the hell? I don't know what that did. Am I supposed to go down here? Eh, who knows? We're going down anyways. I don't think I'm supposed to go down, actually. Oh my god. No, 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 you son of a bitch! Oh, 
That was the second time I died of this race level. Kind of nervous. My power's failing. Alright. I don't know, I'm missing it from Xbox Live, though. Can I connect to Xbox Live? I mean, I could just like wait until this feels over. <laughs> nope, cannot. Okay, that's interesting. We'll have to check that out. I, I, don't, I don't. I guess I really don't need to. Or not going to. Get that. I wonder who the hell uses X for this crap. So, I mean, uses B for that crap instead of X. I mean, I don't know. It's like I would have trouble doing that with my hands. Like using B, that's just. Uh, I guess. I guess. You know what? Maybe I should have beat this already. Uh, I guess you c I could see somebody using B for it, but it's just. I don't know. Because I can press X and A at the same time, it seems easier. I could probably also do that with B, but that'd be just weird. I, guess. Uh, I don't know why you even said that. I had that comment. <laughs> it wasn't really needed, I guess. Was I already here? Yay! Hey, look at this. Look at all the little guys. Can't do any harm to us, but we're gonna kill them anyways. And I think that's a good way to end the episode, you know. With the slaughter of innocent robots, children. So, um, yeah, this has been your host, Banada, and I will see you guys next time. Peace.